Welcome to another tutorial through Peopleistics on leadership and communication. One of the most vital aspects that happens in conversations is that people will oftentimes decline to have the conversation based upon their own fear of their own emotional states or their feeling that they have the inability to create the type of solutions through the conversation. So they'll shut down and they'll repress. And this is one of the most detrimental aspects to leadership, is that when we do not hold the conversation, we slowly deteriorate the quality of the relationship. So because I believe our relationships is really our security towards our success, every successful aspect in business in my professional life and my personal life has really been foundational to the quality of conversation I can have. So when we avoid the conversation, we think we perhaps are saving the relationship, when in reality, we're actually slowly deteriorating and destroying it incrementally. It's a slow decline. So one of the most important aspects of what I desire to present in these next series of tutorials is some of the qualities around having an authentic conversation. Authentic conversation is generally called for when there is difficulty. When there's a difficulty that requires to be addressed, that is when some of the strategies of the authentic conversations can be most powerful.